guys and welcome to Card Making with Crystal. Today we're doing this graduation cap and gown card. I know graduation season is over but I had a friend who has a son that's graduating and she wanted to surprise him with the cutest card and well you know. Uh, we have the graduation cap card but this includes the card. It is so cute. See it opens like this and this. It falls flat and then it stands like this <laughs> let's go down okay hi guys this is everything you need for the card and we're gonna get started with our 10 by 12 piece of paper and we're gonna do some scoring on the 10 side we're gonna score two and a half and seven and a half on the 12 side we're going to score at seven and a half fold and burnish in all your score lines so your paper would look like this now from the bottom here you're going to measure up five and a half inches Make a mark and on the other side you're going to do the same thing. So five and a half inches. Make a mark and you're going to join these two five and a half inches. I'm going to use my T-square ruler to do it so that I know it's straight and I'm going to just draw a line from here to here. And then from here to here. That should leave this as two inches, which it perfectly does, yes. And I'm gonna I want you to go up here, put your two inch mark on this line, and make a mark at two inches up here, and do the same on the other side. Two inches. And I want you to go up here. I know there's a lot of measuring, but believe me, it'll all work out nicely. And and put a mark at two and a half inches. Right. So we drew lines on this side here and here. We put marks here and here, and we put a mark here. So this is what I want you to do now. I want you to put this in your paper cutter. And that's why we scored and burnished so we could make this cut. Up to the score line. And then on the other side, find the line that you made and cut along that line up to the score line. So that is perfect, right? Now I want you to cut these pieces off. This was this was an error, so just ignore that, okay? So I'm going to stick this in my paper cutter like this at two and a half inches, perfectly, and cut this off. And cut it off. Right, so this is how your card should look so far. So you're taking this and you're cutting from here to here and from here to here. And then do the same on the other side. So it should look like this. Now. I'm going to do some scoring again from this corner here. I'm going to put it at six inches to here, right? Score like that, and then you do the same thing on this side, put this at the six inches mark, and then you come up 
and score. And it should make an X right where you have that line there. Now you're going to fold and burnish on your score lines. I'm going to take this in like this and fold this up like so. And this is your cap and gown right here. This is how it looks. This is the end of the base card. Now we're going to put this over here and I'm going to show you how to measure and cut all of these pieces and then we're going to put it all together. So. We're going to start with, this is for the inside of the card here, and all the measurements are in the description, so you're going to measure up on this one. Five and three eighths, so five, five, and one, two, three eighths, and I'm going to make a mark up here, and I'm going to measure five and three eighths on this side as well. Take them off and I'm going to just fold the paper here and get the middle, right? So we have the middle here. Same with this one. I'm going to measure five and a quarter. Make a mark. So I'm going to do all the measuring first and then we're going to put it together. Five and a quarter. Make a mark. And I don't want to... Um, Fold this one. This is four and a half across, so we're going to measure it at two and a quarter. Then you're going to take these, this one, and this is four and five eighths. We're going to mark it at two and one, two, three, four, five of those points. Same with the bottom, four and five eighths. We're going to mark it at two and one, two, three, four, five. Just count five. So when I'm counting, I'm counting two and one, two, three, four, five. So that's considered five sixteenths. All right, now I'm gonna measure down two and a quarter on both sides and two and a quarter on this side here. And I'll take this one and I'll measure This is four and a quarter. So I'll measure two and one eighth. On the top and the bottom. So you basically measure in half. Two and one eighth. And then on this side, I'll measure two and three sixteenths. One, two, three. So two and one, two, three points. And I think we're actually done. So let's do all the cutting, make our tassel and put our card together. So you're going to grab your cutting paper cutter. You're going to put the top here and where you made your mark and cut and do the same on the other side. Top and where you made your mark.
thanks so much for joining me while we made this cute cup and gown graduation card. It's so adorable. <laughs> If you like this video, give it an actual thumbs up, subscribe to the channel so you won't miss any content, and stay crafty my friends.